Now we are going to go through the BIM exception analysis report. This report is used to determine what are the exceptions and invoices goes through. So it gives you an overview what are the uh, what are the general exceptions uh, PO invoice has. So generally it should have generally a needs goods receipt because you want to see the sometimes you want to see the invoices in order to really do the goods receipt. And some other cases we can pinpoint what are the vendors like sometimes we can pinpoint that the vendors are sending us a non-PO invoice and later on we are converting it into a PO invoice. So in those cases we can find the who is at fault whether the vendor is knowingly sending us invoices without the PO number or we are not uh, communicating them the PO number or sometimes it can be a case where we are creating the PO after the fact which can be a case but it's not ideal so in these cases you can take care of those what are the exceptions which is really bogging down our processing and who are responsible for those so this is a uh, typo as, as the name suggests, it's an exception analysis report and it's helpful and is used by all the all the teams like the requisition of the warehouse first person, the accounts payable uh, manager to determine what are the exceptions that are occurring in an invoice life cycle.